So we are in the archive of Tenerife. I'm together with Carlos Cologan. He's a great researcher and a great historian and has done an amazing work about Tenerife, about international trade of Tenerife wines in the history. Thank you, Carlos. Thanks it's a you. really privilege to visit the archive because it's normally they don't open it at all. So let's see what is in there. Let's go. So, Carlos, this is a, a document that you really like to show us. Yes. What is in there? Here we have an, an example of different kinds of documents. For example, these books is a, a copiers of letters. It's the copy that we maintain in the, in the archive mm -hmm. when we send a letter to the foreign uh, or some people. For example, in this document, we have the uh, evidence of the loading of a ship of wine, in this case, wine and fresh water, by a, a ship of Her Majesty, uh, mm -hmm. a, a military ship. In these other documents, uh, we can see a document of payment of wines mm -hmm. mm, that we imagine in that period they don't use, uh, not, they don't usually uh, use uh, metallic money. Mm -hmm they use the new kind of, uh, of payment, this is a uh, letra de cambio. Okay, so these documents are dated from... Uh, the 18th century. 18th century. It was okay. created by the Irish people here mm -hmm. in Tenerife, and they came from Dublin and Waterford. Okay. But uh, the most of the, the commerce mm -hmm. is between England mm -hmm. and Tenerife. And when this trade started, I mean, the commerce between Tenerife and England, from the beginning of the discovering of the canaries, probably okay. in, this, in the 16th century. Yeah. Uh, it was not just about wine, also fruits and, I mean... Uh, mainly with England uh, is wine. Wine, okay. wine and orchilla and some uh, uh, products for okay. uh, tincture, for, okay. for change the colors of the, of the, of the, of the textile material. But actually you have found, like in the archive, they do references to the Tenerife wine. Yes. Yeah. That's uh, the, the ancient the, word they use. Exactly. The, the, in the 18th century, mm -hmm. you always talk about the Tenerife wine. Mm -hmm. It's a Bidonia wine. It's mm -hmm. a white wine. Mm -hmm. If you go to the past, mm -hmm. to the 16th century, probably you will talk about sweet wines, Malvasia okay. wines. Okay. But okay. this period, or, or these archives, is m much stronger in Bidonia wines. Okay. And you have done some, some amazing findings relating this yes. trait about uh, in English, Britain. In every year yeah. you can okay. find in wonderful things. Okay. For example, this paper. Okay, wow. This paper is from 10th of June of 1787. Okay. It's signed by Andrew Miller, mm -hmm. and he's the man uh, who went to the Botany Bay. Okay. And these are the documents signed by the governor, Arthur Phillips, mm -hmm. the chief and the commander of the first fleet in the tra traveling to wow. Australia. Wow. They, they so they were, were stopping yes. and loading wine? Yes, because the, the uh, Tenerife companies of wine had a contract mm -hmm. with the uh, uh, government of England, of uh, Britannic government, and all the ship, mm -hmm. the Navy ships, mm -hmm. had to uh, stop here to take the wines, mm -hmm. the water, mm -hmm. and the beef. Okay, so also and meat, in this yeah. case, the, the, the 11 uh, ships of the first fleet, okay. they come here like uh, military or navy ships. Mm -hmm. And they sing in the, in the several documents, every ship, the quantity of wine that they get, take from Tenerife. Wow. And mm -hmm. probably they take to Australia, to mm -hmm. Botany Bay. Okay, mm -hmm. so are you, are you uh, saying that the first wine that in Australia, in Australia yes. was from Tenerife? Sure, absolutely. Okay. So first wine in, to travel from Europe to Australia was actually from Tenerife. Exactly. So, you know, at least that we can yeah, prove. You, you can read in the document. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so really amazing uh, work. It's, it's like, uh, wow, it's a superb place. And I'm sure you have spent here like hundreds Present. of hours. Yes. Yeah, and that's been uh, super uh, amazing. So we are finding everything on your book here? Yes. So all the best? It's very complicated because to condense in one book mm -hmm. uh, so many kinds of history yeah. in different years is very complicated. Mm -hmm. 
and we put in words the, okay. the most significant okay. events. Oh, yeah. Like James this Cook, one. Yeah. Like this one. Which one at the top? Probably this one, but yeah. I prefer the relationship with the uh, East Indian Company. Okay. okay. It's a very exotic mm -hmm. uh, uh, relation and it's very unknown mm -hmm. that the, the wines of mm -hmm. Tenerife were sent to India. So this is a top place in, in Tenerife. If you were here, you can smell like very old flavors. Yes. And, and it's just an amazing and very moving uh, place to be. Yes. Thank you, Carlos. You're welcome. Thank you. Thanks to you.